Paragon Space Development Corporation is an American company headquartered in Tucson, Arizona. Paragon is a provider of environmental controls for extreme and hazardous environments. They design, build, test and operate life support systems and leading thermal control products for astronauts, contaminated water divers, and other extreme environment explorers, as well as for unmanned space and terrestrial applications. History. Paragon was conceived to combine the expertise of biology, chemistry and aerospace engineering to develop technical solutions to life support and thermal control problems related to human and biological spaceflight. Paragon was founded by five principal partners including Grant Anderson, Tabor McCallum, Jane Pointer, Dave Bearden, and Alicia CESA Peterson. Prior to co-founding Paragon, Anderson was employed at Lockheed Martin, Sunnyvale, California. McCallum and Pointer were members of Biosphere 2 in Oracle, Arizona. David was at the Aerospace Corporation, El Segundo, California, where he is still employed, and CESA was a manager at Lockheed Martin. McCallum served as CEO of Paragon from its inception until his move to serve as Chief Technology Officer of Worldview Enterprises, Inc., a company incubated by Paragon. Jane, formerly president and chairman of the board of Paragon, is now chief executive officer of Worldview. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Current projects. Paragon is providing the CST100 humidity control subassembly (HCS) for cabin atmospheric humidity control of the Boeing Crew Space Transportation System (CCTS) and Crew Space Transportation (CST-100) spacecraft. Paragon, a Lockheed Martin subcontractor on the NASA Orion program, provided the tubing for life support systems including oxygen, heating and cooling and critical sensor packages for the F-1 flight. Paragon is partnered with Oceaneering Space Systems to build an Exploration EVA space suit which will be demonstrated at ISS and will enable NASA's future exploration missions. Paragon is leading the thermal design and analysis effort, and is providing components for the portable life support system. Paragon is under contract with Mars One to develop concepts for life support and spacesuits, with the goal of a manned colony on Mars. History Topic 2014 On November 3, 2014, Paragon announced that Grant Anderson was named President and CEO and Ron Sable was named Chairman of the Board while Jane Pointer and Tabor McCallum had fully transitioned to Worldview Enterprises, Inc. On October 24, 2014, Paragon along with Alan Eustace and the Paragon Stratex team completed a record-breaking near-space dive from an altitude of over 135,000 feet. In September 2014, Paragon was selected by NASA to integrate and fly technology payloads on commercial suborbital reusable platforms that carry payloads near the boundary of space. In June 2014, Paragon announced that its offshoot company, Worldview Enterprises, Inc., successfully completed a scaled systems test of the proposed nominal tourist flight profile to near space. Worldview uses a high altitude balloon to rise to 32 kilometers, 20 miles above the Earth, after which it returns gently back down to Earth beneath a remotely guided parafoil. Although not reaching space, the curvature of the Earth and the blackness of space can be seen. Commercial flights are expected to cost $75,000. Topic 2013 In March 2013, Paragon announced that it had entered into a Space Act agreement with NASA for Inspiration Mars Evaluation. In March 2013, Paragon announced that it had contracted with Mars One to perform an initial conceptual design of the Environmental Control and Life Support System and Mars Surface Exploration Spacesuit System. In February 2013, Paragon announced its involvement with the Inspiration Mars Foundation and their mission to launch an historic journey to Mars and back in 501 days. Topic 2012. In March 2012, Paragon announced that its NASA-funded air revitalization technology would be used in mine refuge chambers. Topic <laughs> Patents. Hazardous environmental diving systems. Cooling systems. Gas reconditioning systems. 
spacecraft radiator systems variable altitude testing systems stable and reproducible sealed complex ecosystems topic see also commercial crew development environmental control and life support systems mars 1 nasa